All right, so we finally got in our circuit boards and our heat shrink, so now we're gonna clean up the switch box we were making a little bit. First thing you're always gonna want to do is make yourself a diagram and try to label out your components. First thing I noticed was the left, right, and the TV all had an RGB. So I just condensed each of those onto the circuit board, then ran a wire directly to the controller so that it could just plug in right there pretty easily. After that, I noticed only the left and the right had a white. So the white is going to be used in one of the switches, so I ended up wiring them directly into those switches so that it would break the wire, and then I would um, wire them back to the controller into the W slot there. After there, I needed to power them. So to power them, I wanted them to turn on by these three switches right there. So what I did was I broke the power supply there, and then I wired them into the controller, which is going to provide the actual power for the light. And the hardest part was the LEDs. So the LEDs, I ended up using a mix of Kirchhoff's loop rule and Ohm's law, essentially stating that if they're in parallel, the same voltage is going to go to each of the components on there. So if I only had one 1000 ohm resistor, that would go to each of the lights. So I ended up breaking the power supply there so I could do that with one and then turn all on all the lights with the top switch. From there, all I needed to do was plug that into the power for the controller, the positive power, and then I needed to take a wire from the negative of the controller into the negative power of the power supply. Now without further ado, let's get started. It's gonna look a little bit messy on the circuit board at first, that's because Dallas had made a previous attempt on this that didn't actually end up working. I think he had his idea right, it was just a matter of executing it that he was a little fuzzy on. That's why I had to make the diagram and then I just ended up doing it while he was at work. And it worked perfectly. Mm -hmm. 